All right. Hey, Center PC fans. We are back. We just recently did the um, PCA peel, and so now we're going to switch gears, and we're going to be doing the Zio Skin Health um, Stimulator Peel. So they are a little bit different when it comes to the peel, especially um, the percentage-wise, where the the P, the Stimulator Peel, what, which peel are we doing? The stimulator <laughs> Peel <laughs> is very much more, um, she's, it's very mild. So you're definitely not going to have any type of peeling with this peel compared to the PCA or the ZO3 step. So it's kind of like if you could, like the I call it the number one, the one that you really want to, it's super aggressive would be your ZO3 step peel. Then if you want to maybe have a step down, we have a little bit of peeling, but still get some results, that would be your PCA peel. The third one would be this one, which is called the stimulator peel. So this is really great for if you want to kind of brighten your skin, you know, get that dead skin off, the stimulator peel is um, great for that. Um, so we're going to talk to you about that stimulator peel and um, right now she's taking off her makeup. Um, sorry about that, Allie. You have to read it. You have to. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. So one thing about the stimulator peel is it's a really great ex exfoliation um, for your skin. So these are great for maintenances or, you know, definitely maybe like a teenager. Great for the stimulator peel. Um, maybe you're having a little some breakout. Stimulator peel is going to be great for that. Um, however, I was going to ask Allison, and, and I'm sorry, I'm going to put you on the spot here. Yeah. What would be the difference between doing a stimulator peel and the hydrofacial? So the hydrofacial would actually give you more of an exfoliation than the stimulator peel, only because it's using the machine, and that's okay. going to use mechanical and chemical exfoliation to your face. Okay. So there is a little bit of difference there, and then also you can do add-ons add yes, with the hydrofacial. Um, but there's probably also a big price difference as well. So the hydrofacial is going to um, probably price higher compared to the stimulator peel. Yes. So if you're price conscious but want to peel, then this might be an option for you. So this is really going to help with um, any type of breakouts. Not as much when it comes to pigmentation. It's still going to make things better for you. Um, but you would probably, if you really want to be aggressive on your pigmentation, then you need to go up a, a couple peels. Um, however, it's going to help with your overall skin health. And especially, it's really great if um, you've had some sort of like laser packages, like especially with the Pico or the CO2. Um, this would be a great peel to kind of keep your results and maintenance, facelifts, anything like that. Um, so that's why we do love these and we love the price point of these peels as well. Um, if you guys have any questions at all during the speed, feel free to... Um, comment below we're happy to answer them um, throughout the peel so this first product she's putting on is the exfoliating polish okay which you can purchase in our um, medical spa here one of our probably one of our number one sellers yes everybody loves the exfoliating polish so this is going to use ultra fine magnesium crystals to help break up and loosen some of this dead skin for her Now, do you need to stop any type of retinols prior to this peel? Not this peel. Okay. So with the PCA peel, you would need to stop a retinol as well as a ZO3 step, but this one you do not. On the exfoliating polish, do you use that, what, twice, three times a week? Yes, no more than three times a week. And this is the exfoliation portion of the peel? Yes. Okay. Now, is, will there be any type of pain with this peel at all? Like any burning or stinging? Shouldn't have any pain with this peel. Okay. So no if, irritation. So if that's something you're afraid of, this is a great peel for you as well. Yes, absolutely. It's going to be very, very gentle and mild. What about any downtime with this peel? No downtime with this peel. Okay. What about, does this peel stay on? for a long period or can you put makeup on right after it or 
So this peel um, will actually come off, so it's not one that's going to sit on your face. So you can absolutely put makeup on right after this one. Okay, perfect. And again, for those who are jumping on, um, if you haven't already, we actually just recently just did a PCA peel live on Facebook, not on Instagram, um, but we did do a live on Facebook. So if you wanted to check out the PCA peel, which is a step up above this one, you do have to keep that one on your face. Um, you will have some slight peeling with that. Um, you can go to our Facebook page and watch that. And if you have any questions for Allison at all or myself, um, feel free to ask them. We're here. You can um, DM us. We're happy to always answer your questions so we try to get back to you within a day if we can um, that's our goal at least or you can always give us a call and this Allison we answer them for you yes <laughs> so we have both Allison's today <laughs> with me one's Allie one's Allison that's how we keep them straight <laughs> Now, would this peel be really great if you're having acne breakouts? Yeah, it would okay. be nice for acne breakouts. Okay. We actually have a sulfur mask that we can pair with this, okay. which will help dry out some of that um, acne that's down in there. Okay, good to know. And a lot of these products you're using, can you purchase them? In yes, okay. you absolutely can. And I'm going to mention this again. I mentioned this on our last feed a couple minutes ago. Is lately I've been seeing a lot on social media um, where pe people can actually um, do take home pills. Um, Alice and I were talking about this where you can, it's like you open it up, you put the jar in, and then you put it on your face. Um, this peel, of course, is a very mild peel. So, however, the peels that we do, the PCA peel and the three step peel, um, can be very aggressive. They have lots of acids in them. And, you know, make sure you're very careful. Um, and those take home peels on the internet is not something I would recommend. I mean, these ladies that do these peels have had years of experience and schooling. They know all about the skin anatomy. Um, so it's really important you know what you're putting on your face. Um, and, you know, like I said, we talked about in the PCA peel, you get frosting with that peel, which means gives Allison, she knows that that's her end point when it comes to that part of the skin. Um, someone who may be not educated in that wouldn't know that and would continue to put the peel over their face. So um, it's really important that you're going to a licensed esthetician when it comes to any type of peels. Okay, so just taking the rest of this polish off and then we are actually gonna get started on your stimulator peel. The stimulator peel is gonna eat away at any dead skin on your face. It'll help with your pores and any acne. Perfect. So I'm first gonna go ahead and prep your skin with the peel prep, just to get you ready. One pass. Mm, I smell it. So she's prepping her skin for the stimulator peel. important is when you're doing peels you want to make sure you stay you know careful uh, especially around the eye yes <laughs> that can be really scary so she's very careful when it goes up to the um, the bone there so she, she'll make sure you're you're careful as well oh great question how much is this peel Do you this want to know? peel is 95 okay so great to know so this is 95 dollars so those compared to like a hydrofacial or the PCA peel um, or the three-step peel, this is a great price point um, for that. So it's 95, where our hydrofacials start off at 150. Correct. Our PCA peels start off at 125. Correct. And the Zio is... Um, 175. 175, okay. 
So I'm going to start with your first layer. I can do two layers with this peel. You might feel a slight tingle or an itch. How does it feel so far, Allison? Feels good. Good. <laughs> oh, I'm so positive. <laughs> Whereas I know before when we did the PCA peel recently, you know, it definitely had a little bit more of a bite to it. Yes, it did. So I know Amy was still in the sting of that one, where this one, not as much. Yeah, very mild. Good. Just letting that absorb in. And we'll do another layer. Will she receive frosting with this one? She will not receive any frosting with this one. It's not going to penetrate as deep as the other two. Okay. This is a very superficial peel, Got it. what we call it. And are you feeling comfortable for one more layer? Yeah. Perfect. Good. And this would be, this peel I feel like is really great for people who haven't had a peel done before. Yes. Like a starter peel. Yes. As well as um, teens. Yes. Very good for teens, adolescents. And what I love about this peel is there's definitely no downtime and you can put makeup on afterwards. Yes. So if that's something you're a little self-conscious about, um, especially if maybe you have some breakouts, I would be like that. Um, this peel you can actually put makeup on and you can just go about your day. Now, can you work out? Can you shower? I would say limit working out for at least a day or two. Um, but other than that, showering, you can shower right after if you wanted to mm -hmm. that night or the next morning. Okay. Again, a lot of these products that you're seeing are in our um, medical spa that you can actually purchase, um, which is great. Like exfoliating polish, you can take that home and use in between your treatments. The, there's cleansers, there's um, sunscreens. So now we're just removing the peel because we don't let this one sit on the face. And as you can see too, we don't remove your eye makeup with any peels. Because Allie's got some pretty lashes today. Yes, you do. <laughs> Both Allie's. I'm looking at them. <laughs> Again, for those who are <laughs> for tuning in, this peel is $95. Um, no downtime. I put makeup on afterwards. Um, the peel we prior did to this live, um, the live prior on Facebook was the PCA peel, which is a step above this peel, and that is $125 with take home products. So definitely different peel, and that's the one thing I love about um, the Center PC is we give you multiple options. So options for your price range, options for your skin, you know, if you want downtime, if you don't want downtime, your lifestyle. So um, that's what's great is we have the three-step peel, the PCA peel, the stimulated peel, and we also have the hydrofacial, which is a totally different, um, different type of procedure. And there's definitely some new, um, which we showed on our one of our videos recently. Allison and I actually did it a couple yeah. weeks ago. Um, we also have some new serums for those. We have the Bright Alive. We have the uh, Rose Trial. We're getting ready to add on the lip perks um, and eye perks that will be added on to our hydrofacial as well. So those will be new coming up in the end of September, which will be amazing because we are the only ones in the um, area that have those perks. So if you're thinking about possibly lip injections, 
um, that would be a great to have a hydrofacial and have the add the lip perk on. You can actually see if you would like some lip injections. Same thing with under eyes. So I'm really excited to be doing those lives coming up at the end of September or early October. Also, if you guys are interested, um, Dr. Downs and myself recently um, just recorded um, some podcast series. So those are going to be coming up at the end of September as well. Um, and they're going to talk beauty, lifestyle. So make sure um, you watch our social media pages for those as well as any type of specials or event going on. Make sure you um, like and subscribe to all of our social media, which includes Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, Twitter, Snapchat. We do it all. So right now I'm using the Aloe Hydration Gel. It feels really good. To massage your skin. And at the same time, this will help with any redness. And if you're feeling very dry, this will help your skin lock in that moisture. You can also leave this on additionally for 10 minutes as a mask. Okay. If you would choose. Can you put the, uh, cause I know we have the uh, Brightenol mask on too. Can you yeah. do that as well? Yeah, you absolutely can okay. use the Brightenol mask as well. Do we have one of those in the room that we could show? Um, you know, I think it's in the other room. It's in okay. room four. Okay. Sorry. Sorry, guys. But they are their neat little masks that we're, you're able to put on. Um, it's a little sheet mask that mm -hmm. you peel off. And those are great. So if you ever want to add those on to any of your services, just let the girls know. And we can definitely do that. And those come from the Zio line. My nose is cold, so when you do that, it feels good. <laughs> <laughs> so this is definitely a more relaxing mm -hmm. peel Very. compared to the others. So if you're ever looking to just kick back, it's a 45 minute treatment. Yeah, we tend to speed up the treatments in our lives. Yes. Sorry, Allie. No, it's okay. <laughs> I'm relaxed. <laughs> Allison will take more time with you. <laughs> mm -hmm. You're going to use a hot towel on your face to remove. Now, so you did your um, aesthetics training in New York, is that correct? Yes, I did. Yeah, that's what I thought. Normally, if you're here too, we have some relaxation music we're playing, and we dim the, the lights, but due to the live, it's a little bit more social media friendly. This is from the CY line? Yes, it is. Right, which they can purchase. What does the Dermal Restore do? So Dermal Restore is going to, it acts as a moisturizer, so it's going to help keep you nice and hydrated. It's definitely one to use if you feel like um, you are very hydrated mm -hmm. in um, the winter time. It's a Plus, more thick 
moisturizing cream. It's also great carry. though for summer though, if you get like a sunburn. Yes, absolutely. The Dermar Store would be something I would recommend. Do you know the price point on that? Price point, I believe it's 60 ish. That's on right now? Mm hmm. 60 ish at the Dermar Store, which you can purchase. It's like 67 Also going to be using Perfect Foundation. Oh, my favorite. So this has a tint, which you can also purchase. Do you know the price point on that? Price point forty-five. Thank oh, you. There you go. Beat me to it. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> now that is probably one of our number one sellers. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. What SPF is this? This 20. is an SPF of twenty-five. Okay. You might have said that and I just missed it. Again, this is a stimulator peel where at the end of it, putting the sunscreen on. Um, you know, it's really great for if you want more of a facial feel with the peel results. This is a great, um, it's great for beginners on peels. There's no stinging, no downtime. You can put makeup on afterwards. Um, the price is $95. And we do those here Monday through Friday. You're awesome, my dear. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Allie. Thank you. All right, you guys. So I'm going to switch cameras. Bye, Instagram. I'm going to say goodbye to them. And that. Um, so again, for those who watch, we do Facebook Fridays every Friday. We do a different type of um, service or talk about different products. Um, if you guys have any questions, make sure you um, DM us on Instagram or message us on Facebook here. You can also ask questions below and we'll answer them throughout the weekend. Um, we hope you guys have a great weekend and um, we'll see you back next Friday. Bye guys.